Welcome to Hardy Classics on a sunny spring Saturday afternoon. Bit of a mouthful, that. Uh, what have we got here? Today, we've got something special again. I only really try and sell special things. Uh, it's a Bedford HA Double Plus. And Double Plus means special edition. So, looking at the van from the outside, straight away you can see chrome up caps, chrome mirrors, and obviously metallic blue paintwork. Round the back, chrome bumpers. And I can't remember whether they had chrome bumpers or they didn't have chrome bumpers. I had three or four of these vans as a, a young fellow, and, and I can't remember. The Tem Reg, 1974. Um, it's got the standard little, I think it's a 1275 in these, or a 1225 or something. It's the same engine they had in the Vauxhall Viva, and they put that engine in the Chevette. Um, reliable little engine, but 40,000 miles, and the things are knackered. Um, this one's actually got the original engine in, in a box in the back. If you wanted to rebuild it, um, someone's obviously rebuilt that engine. Um, it wouldn't be a bad thing to rebuild it, and I don't think it would cost a lot of money. Um, it's been in the guy's collection for a long time. It's a super, super rare thing. I don't know how many's on the road, but there'll only be a handful. And there'll only be even less than a handful of double pluses. It's got to be one of the rarest little commercials out there. Going around the side of it, um, you'll see it's metallic blue paintwork. Inside, it was fitted with carpet. Um, a different type of vinyl seat, a blue vinyl seat, and also a factory fitted rear seat. None of these would be standard in the normal standard van. Loads of all cards here. Um, the doors are nice. There's no rust on the doors. The big wax oil at the bottom there, look. Um, the bodywork's not perfect. You know, it's got a few painting imperfections, a few dings and dongs. It's a commercial. It's going to have, but to survive like that, it's amazing. Right, we'll have a look at the engine. Like I say, these are at 1200, 1250, 1275. I can't really remember. But there it is. Same engine as a, as a Chevette. And the reason the people like these vans back in the day was you could change that engine two or three hours in and out you know this was a staple transport for water boards post offices you know gas boards everybody had bedford ha vans but they rotted to death they just the engines were too too underpowered and the body work they rotted to death so this to survive is a real treasure like i say first one i bought i paid 90 quid for it Right, we'll look inside it. There we go. Like I say, the blue interior, the blue dash. I think this one's shown 67,000 miles, which it could be right. I mean, judging by the carpets and seats and, and stuff, it could be right. Uh, and judging by the spare engine in the back, like I said, 40, 45, 50,000. The engine's reduced, so it could be right. There's a crate in the back, and there's the original engine. There's a few spares in that. We'll sort them out when... Uh, when we get this up ready we haven't prepped it ready for sale yet so it does need a good valet a good clean and, and probably need to go through the workshops get the brakes done we always check the brakes we change the fluids the oils the antifreeze check it out you know if the brakes are more than 50 percent we'll whip them off and put new brakes on you know so it goes out nice and safe but it is what it is 